Hey guys, today I just want to talk about the web. The web, actually the year 2010, but also the web. How many people send emails? How many people are using the web? Do you want to find that out? Well, I'm going to go through all of that things in this video. But first, okay, so let's go ahead and go to my channel and see how many people watch my videos. Okay, so as you can see here, I have uploaded 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 videos to the last 24 hours and I have been getting some people that have been viewing each one of them actually this one is pretty popular, 141 views and I mean, obviously these people come from the web, okay? These are mostly guys that I don't know it's not my friends that I watched the video and we just reloaded it, but it's the web it's the magical things that is happening when you upload videos if you upload something on YouTube millions of people browse YouTube every day so if you upload something to the cloud people are going to watch it if you put tags and you know a good title people are going to watch your video so basically that's like a 100% guarantee if you put out the video, let's say you put out the video with the title iPad 2 news room or something like that it's almost impossible to get zero views on that video yes that's that's true because the web it's a lot of people on the web so let's go through the numbers for 2010 okay so the first thing we got is email how many emails are people sending now many people send spam as you probably already do know so 107 trillion emails that got sent in the internet 2010 so how much is 107 trillion well it's it's simple it's 1 million millions yeah that's sick and then 294 billion that's the average number of email email messages sent every single day and I mean think about it. billions that's one that is 294,000 millions yeah it's sick number of emails users worldwide worldwide 1.88 billion now that is that is a sick number because yeah it, it's a crazy number and new emails users sent since the year before 480 million so it's increasing with a lot of people still I mean we, we're only 6 billion guys on this earth so still it's, it's kind of sick actually and that almost yeah almost 2 billion use the web that is kind of sick number of spam emails sent every single day 262 billion now, th this is sick. Okay, so we have a total of average number of email messages sent every day, 294. And spam messages, that is like almost every single email that is sent is spam. So that that's kind of sad actually. But uh, hey, that's the way it is. That's why I like never use the email because it kind of sucks. I get spam every single day, all the time. Number of email accounts worldwide, almost 3 billion. Now that is sick also. Pretty much, I mean it's the half of the guys on our earth. So that's kind of sick. 25% share email accounts that are corporate. Okay, that's kind of a lot. Now, let's go over to websites. Let's say you have a website running. Now, how many guys do you have to compete with? Well, the number of websites in December 2010, it was 255 million. And, yeah, I, I, it may sound a lot, but then you have to think that almost 2 billion people are browsing the web. So, 255 million, I actually don't think that it sounds like that much. It's kind of good actually. So, you know, if you have a really good website, you can probably be one of those guys in the top 50 million websites because there's a lot of crap out there. And yeah, so that is kind of cool actually. 255 million and 21.4 million added websites in 2010. It wasn't that much though. And yeah, we have some web service statistics. 
I actually don't think it's that kind of interesting, so let's just go down. Domain names, how many .com, as you probably already do know, that .com is the biggest one with 88.8 .8 million websites that's using that domain. Then we have .net, and then .org, and then we have, you know, some country code top level, you know, CN, UK, DE, SE for Sweden, yeah, we use SE. And yeah, that's kind of good, but obviously you always want to have this .com. I'm not sure why that one become became the biggest one. Probably is because I think .com that's for company. Yeah, it must be that. Yeah, so obviously that is the leader. Then we have the internet users, and as I said before, we are almost two billion internet users. And guys, that is a lot of people, and a lot of those guys. They search on YouTube, and that's why my videos is gaining views. And then we have a 14% increase users since the previous year. Now, uh, this number is still kind of high. It's actually really high, if you ask me. And internet users in Asia, 825 million. Okay, that's kind of sick. But most of my videos on YouTube, they aren't watched by guys from Asia. So yeah, that, that kind of sucks, actually. Because most of the views I get is from US, and yeah, and it lives like 400 million people in US. So I'm missing out a lot of people here, like, I don't know, yeah, Asia, and some other cool countries that I never get views from. And it kind of sucks, actually. I think Asia, they need to get involved more with the YouTube thingy, because it's awesome. Yeah, it's awesome. And then we have the social media. Social media is a big thingy. So how many blogs do we have out there? 152 millions of blogs. And the thing with blogs is they are very easy to set up and make and then you could, you know, forget about it. And I mean, it's like Blogspot, you just set up a blog in seconds. You don't have to create a website and that's why the number of blogs is so high. And then we have numbers of sent tweets on Twitter in 2010 and this is 25 billion 25 billion tweets new accounts 100 million and 107 million people on Twitter as of September 2010 now it doesn't sound that much if you compare it to Facebook that is around 600 million I think, yeah, they're closing into 600 million users at least, and I mean, it, it's going to be really epic when Facebook is going to hit 1 billion people registered on that site. That is that is kind of sick actually, because it only lives like 6 billion, soon 7 billion people on this earth, and that over 10% of those guys have a Facebook account, where you can see everything they like and stuff like that, that is kind of sick. And then we have 7.7 .7 million people following Lady Gaga. And yeah, that's crazy. 600 million people on use Facebook, as I said. 250 new people on Facebook in 2010. Oh my god, that is a high number. But yeah, that is true actually. Before 2010, Facebook, you know, in 2009, that was when Facebook really, you know, was starting to get huge. And now 2010, this was the year when everyone you know that didn't have Facebook before they got it and then we have the content that shared on Facebook every single month and it's 30 billions of content like links notes photos and more and you know this is a high number if you compare it to how many how many numbers of sent tweets it was on Twitter the whole year of 2010 25 billion now Facebook passed that 25 billion mark in one month, 30 billions, it's crazy, it's sick. So yeah, people share a lot of things on Facebook and I've seen that on videos that I've been uploading or vi viral videos, like some videos could have like 20,000 views and 5,000 people have shared that video on Facebook, 5,000, that is 25%. And that is sick actually, people share a lot of videos on Facebook and I do it as well. Yeah, I share like two videos every day. Yeah, that's sick. But hey, I'm a YouTube fan. Then we have 20 millions 
and that is the number of different Facebook apps that is installed each day and that's kind of low yeah it's kind of low still then we have the awesome web browsers and as you can see in the explorer it is getting smaller by the day I made a video not that long ago about that in the explorer they was under this 50% of market share and now they are only soon at 46% and it's awesome because Google Chrome is really stepping up it's getting bigger and you know in no time it's going to be bigger than Firefox and I, I just can't wait to that thingy because I'm a Google fanboy yeah I'm, I'm a really Google fanboy I use all of the different services I use YouTube I use Blogspot yeah I use most of their things, I use their Google browser and I'm probably going to buy their computer when they release it, maybe, I don't know. And then we'll obviously we'll have Safari and Opera in the bottom as always with their fanboys, yeah. And then we we'll have the videos on YouTube, we have 2 billion videos that is being watched every single day on YouTube. And yeah, and that gets 60, 60 billion 60 billion views on YouTube each month and I mean that is really much compare that to how many Facebook shares it is per month 30 billion and it's twice as many views so if you are a content producer on YouTube right now I mean you are epic win 60 billion views it is, it is, it is, it is, it is crazy, it is crazy. And yeah, obviously we have 35 hours of video uploaded to YouTube every single minute. And I'm like one of those hours every minute. No, I can't upload that fast, but yeah. It's sick, it's awesome. 186, that is the number of online videos on average internet users watch in a month. Wow, 186 videos every single month yeah I think I watch like 50 videos every day or something like that at least so that could actually be true but 186 videos that is kind of sick actually it's like five or six videos every day and yeah that's in crazy so now we know that videos they are important it's it's important people like videos people like videos more than blogs because they watch 60 billion yeah, used by 60 billion views every month. It's sick. And then we have the share of internet users that watch videos online. 84%. Still insane. It's very high. 2 billion. That is the number of watch videos per month on Facebook. Per month. Facebook. That is the view count, that is the thing that YouTube is doing in one day. So yeah, Facebook isn't really doing this video kind of thingy, but I think they're going to focus on it a lot more in the future. I think they're going to be more like YouTube in the future. And I think in some way, I mean, the, the big thing with YouTube is that you can be anonymous and if Facebook would create a ser video kind of thingy service, then you know you would no longer be anonymous when you comment and I've seen all of these big guys on YouTube that get tons of views, tons of comment then you go to their Facebook fan page I mean some of these guys are really big at YouTube but when they post an update on Facebook they get like two or three comments it's insane, it's crazy and then we have 20 million that is the videos uploaded to Facebook per month and yeah th that's nothing that's really low actually I have I think I have uploaded four videos yeah but Facebook isn't really focusing on this video kind of thing and yeah I think it's good because that means that YouTube is going to have that kind of thingy so that's awesome and then we have the images we have 5 billion photos po hosted by Flickr of Septem on September 2010. Now, all of these 5 billion, it doesn't sound really high when you compare it to videos. Like, yeah, it, it doesn't really sound that high. Because this is the total amount, 5 billion. And, uh, yeah, it, it's still kind of high. 3,000 videos, photos uploaded per minute to Flickr. Now, I never use Flickr, I don't think I'm going to use Flickr and we have some other cool things here about the images and yeah that is about 
everything. And yeah, this cool post, it's kind of awesome. I'll leave a link in the description if you would like to check it out a little more. So yeah guys, if you like this video, please comment, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.